It is very person to person dependent right. and it is understandable if a female feels weaker the week before her cycle and maybe the first few days of her cycle. But right. So how does that affect the training? Um, so we just work with that. It, it's just like, but it's very person dependent. So I don't change. So we need to be cognizant of who we are and, and how our system operates. Yeah. And each one of us will experience different symptoms. I don't get any cramps. I don't really, I don't really know what my well, it's not like I, I track it, but I don't like physically experience a heap of shitty things. I experience like maybe a bit of like bloating, water retention, that kind of notion. No. But um, I, I would pin it down to the fact that I train and eat quite nutritionally dense foods that I don't really experience some of the symptoms that right, okay. um, right, so a female would. Right. And also right. down to genetics as well. Like there no. is a component okay. always. Um, and that's why it's very context dependent. That's why like with my, my girls, I just like – we work through that. I get them to do weekly check-ins. I talk with them throughout the week all the time. Anyway, um, but it's all about just catering to them. That's a topic you're cognizant of throughout the training program.